culture We've in the, the, the complacent flow of a country like Egypt now. Stand in this competition. This cannot be just another workshop, international or local. A country like Egypt now, unless you kick it hard, nothing will come out of it. And that's what we're, we're going after this evening. But it has to be a very special event because we're dealing with a very special subject. As designers, we're always, when you we say we're interested in the question of identity, uh, we're interested in the theoretical discussion behind that, trying to identify what is the deep meanings behind that, uh, that question. Most of the companies that we are dealing with are interested, of course, naturally in new product ideas. We as Egyptians must step back to look at the pyramid. Because when you are on the, on the, on the step of the film, you don't see the film. What you can do is use our eyes. Yeah, we see it just different. There's a difference between identity and what you can't see. Whatever we have today, we connect to that nature. Everything was placed in a specific point with very accurate angles and calculated. Um, it's all comparing to the pharaohs. Just because you're adapting to your environment doesn't mean that you're changing and you're losing your identity. It just means that you're evolving. The influence is on the Egyptian collective memory, which is Islamic, Iranic, Coptic, Turkish, and French, yeah. and English. Pop, 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 pop. And then yeah. it's a stereotype because there are super mm. things that are happening. Yes, uh, uh, a marriage. It's like a marriage. When you are alone, you only see everything in from the inside. It has to be changing. It's something that changes people from the way of thinking. Coming to that fantastic dynamic city, which is kind of like already kind of like has its reputation as being one of the noisiest or the noisiest city in in the world. So kind of like the noise, the sound level itself must be also somehow represented. We need now is a serious rupture. They were all lost, even me with them, I was lost in, in for some time. But To live other experiences and to see uh, other places and to know other people, it makes you free every time more and more. Uh, identity, do you know? Uh, identity um, is? It's not something that you know or intellectualize. Or analyzed but with your mind, DNA. It, it should be felt in your core, it is the flowing, the blood flowing, the, the, the DNA. Once we really discussed it and once we had it, we kind of threw it out the window. We work with clay for instance, but we work with Egyptian water, we work with the Egyptian sun, so that is also being different than working in another country. It is a hundred years from now, you know, the year 2108. Looking back, what do you want to see? There's, let's say, not one one way of solving this or thinking about this. That there's just with the seven designers, there are seven different uh, ways of approaching the problem. It's also fascinating.